Check, mic check.
about to get things underway tonight. Three big games on the horizon against Washington, Philadelphia, and the Vikings. Celebration guy is ready. The Giants cheer is ready. Everybody is doing good tonight. This Tuesday evening. And of course, as is usually the case, my fucking controller isn't recognizing. Uh, I should just buy a wireless controller. forget to check that when I set up. I figure I'll know as soon as I pick it up if it's going to work or not though, huh? <laughs> All right. Let the game begin. Don't think anybody needs to be edited. I usually check on that before I end the streams. Are going to skip to let's see. Actually, we got to skip to week week eleven this time. Because we have a bye week. Chomping on some fresh watermelon. It's actually starting to get kind of hot down here for the first time this year. Pushing into the 90s. Been uh, unseasonably cool so far this May. I haven't turned my air conditioner on once. Which, living in Florida, says a lot. All right. condition kicking things off here tonight. Looks like everybody's in decent condition. And we are ready to go. Giants versus Eagles, game number one here on the stream tonight. has won the kickoff and I have elected to receive Elliot to kick off Slayton back to receive for Big Blue and Darius Slayton with a 14 yard return to get things underway here in this NFC East matchup 
Giants so far on the season are 6-0. and Rolling out. Barkley, the only open receiver. Barkley hits the first down and then fumbles. Thankfully, it rolls out of bounds. Not a good way to start things off for Saquon. Al Bundy with the pitch up top. Bundy fighting for maybe a yard. Second down and nine for the Giants. Eagles defense coming in hot and heavy. Incomplete pass intended for Bundy. Third down and nine for New York. Ready, set, let's... Eagles defense all over me so far in this ball game. Fourth down and nine. Ball on the 39-yard line. Eh, we're going to go ahead and punt. No sense taking chances this early in the ball game. <laughs> And potentially digging ourselves a hole that we may not be able to get out of. And Jenkins tackled. Five yard gain on the kickoff return. Ooh, Wentz able to get the ball off before he was hit. That would have certainly been a safety. Once again, holding on to it. Sanders tackled three-yard loss on the play. Third down and 12 for Philadelphia. Incomplete pass. Eagles going to be forced to punt. Going to watch for the fake and hopefully get a block. If we could get a block and cover that ball up in the end zone, that would have been a touchdown. Not going to happen, however. Darius Slayton going to call a fair catch so I don't get plowed into and risk another fumble. Giants going to start on the 36-yard line of Philadelphia or of their own. Barkley with a handoff. Barkley hanging up on the lineman. First down run. Barkley jumping. A couple of spin moves. And Saquon Barkley with a big run. 51 yards. To put the Giants on the 12 yard line of Philadelphia. Well within scoring range. Bundy coming up the middle. Bundy not going to get anything. They're going to give him a yard. <laughs> Philly. Defense. Got the sack. Whoa. And that's a big turnover for the Giants. Hit me so hard I fumbled the ball. Philadelphia regained control. Eagles defense with a big play here early on. And Jordan Howard has the first down. Zach Ertz with the catch and another first down for Philly. Minute 23 left here in the first quarter. No score so far. Giants fumbling on that last possession. After the Eagles blitz, knocked the ball right out of my hand. Second fumble of the game for the Giants. The first one by Saquon. Off of a short pass out of the backfield. Luckily, I was out of bounds. Third down and seven for Philadelphia. Giants.
trying not to give up the six points on this. <laughs> Wentz, plenty of time, hits Ertz over the middle for another first down. 11 yard gain on the play for Philly. And they get a fresh set of downs with 37 seconds left. Up top to Alshon Jeffrey. 24 yard gain on that pass. And the Eagles now inside the Giants 20 yard line. Aguilar open in the end zone. Die, Eagles, die, and fuck your victory. 26-yard touchdown pass. Wentz to Aguilar. And the Eagles score first. Extra point is good. That turnover paying dividends for Philadelphia. And the Giants now down 7-0. Darius Slayton back to receive the kickoff. Slayton makes a jump. Spin move, spin move, spin move. Another jump, Slayton all the way, baby. Touchdown, Giants. As time runs out in the first quarter, Darius Slayton with an 85-yard touchdown off the kick return to answer Philadelphia's score. Extra point will tie the ball game. It's up, it's good. begin the second quarter with a 7-7 tie. <laughs> Norris Jenkins, 13 yards on the kick return. And Philadelphia back out on offense. Little effort to move the ball last time they had the ball. And Howard picks up three. was made on the play. Philadelphia third down and one. And Sanders has a first down and a hell of a lot more. 31 yard gain for Miles Sanders. Sanders up the middle picks up another two second down and seven for Philly <laughs> Mom, I told you I stream at eight o'clock every night calling me while I'm streaming. <laughs> Credit my mother for calling me for that first down. And Sanders only picking up a yard on that second down and three, Philadelphia. Change my defensive. Wentz, plenty of time. Tries to connect to Ertz. Throws it just out of reach. Blue 43. Blue 43. 
Third down and three for Philly. Sanders up top, not going anywhere. Philadelphia going to settle for a field goal. We are still going to watch for the fake. And they tried to fake it, and they paid the price. We will celebrate that one. Score still tied at seven. Giants, however. That offensive line has been getting abused by Philadelphia all night. And we're starting deep in our own territory here. Ball on the 10 yard line. Capone up top to Ingram. Ingram makes the catch. And is brought down at about the 48 yard line. 36 yard gain on the play. Gives us a little bit of breathing room. Which we are very grateful for. Ready, set, set. <clears throat> Barkley with the pitch. Barkley already has one fumble tonight. Holds on to it for five that time. Second down and four for the Giants. Barkley up the middle. Breaks that tackle. Barkley off to the races. Only has one guy to beat. And Saquon into the end zone for the score. And the Giants take a lead. 46-yard scamper for Barkley. Already over 100 yards today. <laughs> Extra point by Beard is good. And Giants now lead 14-7 here in the second quarter. Got about a minute 34 left here in the first half. <laughs> 16 yard return on the play. Sanders still in at back for Philadelphia. <laughs> One yard loss. Second down and 11 for the Eagles. They've got that double Jordan Howard play in the playbook. And Wentz hits Howard out of the backfield. Big 26 yard gain for the first down. Philly moving to chains. Looking to get one more score in before the half. Philadelphia will receive the kickoff at the beginning of the third quarter. So if they can go into the half with a little bit of momentum and then come back out with possession. Only serves their offense. Wentz going to run it. He gets caught. Alec Ogletree with the sack. Third down and 10 for Philly. Carson Wentz, incomplete pass. Intended for Aguilar. And Philadelphia gonna punt, gonna watch for the fake. <laughs> They've been doing fakes a lot more this season than they usually do. And we got a block. Giants taking over with great field position. Starting out here on the 45 yard line of the Eagles. Al Bundy picks up five yards. We're going to get one more playoff before the half. Going to try to make it count. Capone back to pass. Hits Bundy. First down, but no touchdown. 16-yard gain on the play. And as we go to the half, Giants with a 14-7 lead. 107 yards on the ground running. 52 through the air for 159 total. 
Philly, 30 yards rush, 136 through the air, 166 total. One sack for each defense. Philadelphia, two fumbles, two forced fumbles on the Giants. One recovered that led to their first score. And Philadelphia almost double in time of possession so far in this ballgame. That turnover so far. Even though the Giants have the lead, it's a very slim lead. Philadelphia defense has been punishing my offensive line. And we got an interception, baby. Brett Hart, first pick of the stream tonight. Hopefully many more to come. Capone deep to Chark. Chark extends, makes the catch, and is brought down at the three-yard line. 26-yard gain on the play. First and third. Goal line situation here for the Giants. Al Bundy loses a yard. Second down and four for the Giants. And Barkley not going anywhere. Third down and three. Philadelphia making a defensive adjustment. Capone back to pass. Barkley open in the end zone for the touchdown. Eight yard touchdown snag for Saquon. And the Giants lead now extended to two touchdowns. Extra point is up. It is good. Jenkins with the re return. Jenkins still on his feet. Breaks those all those tackles. He had about six guys holding on to him, and he gets away. Miles Sanders. Big, big first down run. 14-yard gain for the Eagles to move the chains. Alshon Jeffrey pulls that one down. Gain of seven on the play. Second down and three for Philadelphia. Ooh, 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 ooh. Wentz is lucky that that was not intercepted. Ooh. Dove a little too soon. Blake Martinez missed Sanders. Miles Sanders good for five yards and a first down. Wentz connects to Aguilar for six. Second down and three for Philly. Blue 
Incomplete pass intended for Ertz. Aguilar with the first down catch, 18 yards on the play. Eagles just have had no problem just marching right up the field on this Giants defense so far tonight. I'm shocked they've only scored seven points so far. Sanders hitting the backfield for a one-yard loss on that play, however. Sanders. Eight yard catch, third down and three. And Sanders stopped in the backfield, loses a yard. Philadelphia going to attempt another field goal. Their first one missed back in the second quarter. It's up. And it is blocked again. Giants with the recovery. Second blocked field goal attempt for the Giants tonight. Much better field position this time. This time we're actually starting on our 22-yard line instead of on a 10. And <laughs> with that 10-yard loss from the sack by Edwards... Might as well be starting on the 10 yard line. Second down and 19. <laughs> Philly coming in fast again. Incomplete pass. Third down and 19 for the Giants. Ready. Oh. Fuck. Fletcher Cox puts me on my ass, and the Eagles' defense picks up two points. Janoris Jenkins back to receive. Philadelphia is still down 21 to 9, however. Jenkins, hard man to tackle this game. Sanders might have got a yard out of that. Second down, nine. Wentz, incomplete pass. Looked like Ertz was the intended receiver. Jordan Howard tackled in the backfield for a five-yard loss. Philadelphia going to go for it. Still a lot of time here in the fourth quarter. 4.33 remaining. Miles Sanders breaks through. And he is brought down. Turnover on downs for the Eagles. Giants dodge a huge bullet on that one. That would have sucked if I'd have given them that much. Barkley with the handoff picks up nine. Second down and one for the Giants. Ah! Looking down the field, not watching my back. God damn it! Oh, incomplete pass intended for Galladay. Fourth down and 15, ball on the 49-yard line. You know what? Fuck it. We are going to go for it. 
I'm probably making a big mistake by doing this, but... Deep to DJ Chark. Do 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 DJ Chark. Do 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 DJ Chark. Do 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 DJ Chark. Fifty-eight yard touchdown reception off of fourth and fifteen, and the Giants' lead extends once again. I needed that one. I needed to show this computer who the boss was. And I mean that as kind as possible. So you don't pull one of your fucking glitch resets on me. 18 yard return for Janoris Jenkins. And Philadelphia with three minutes left to play. Needs to score and score fast. Sanders only a one yard gain on that one. Philly gonna start calling timeouts. going to be able to convert on that one. Fourth down and seven. They are going to go for it. Wentz coming up. Turnover. Coming up short. Another turnover on downs forced by the Giants defense tonight. Barkley pick up a four yard run on that play. Second down and six for New York. Red, 42, red, 42. Barkley made the catch in traffic. First down, 16 yard gain. Lucky that was not picked off because there were two Eagles on top of him. And Al Bundy going to suffer a one yard loss on that play. Ready, set. Bundy gets Touchdown. in on the edge. Touchdown, Giants. is going to do it for the Eagles hopes of coming back in this game pretty sure they're not going to be able to overcome that much of a deficit in just a minute 39 35-9 Giants Janoris Jenkins back deep for the Eagles he's going to take it out of the end zone Jenkins has proven to be hard to tackle tonight 28 yards on that return. Giants play of the game tonight so far. That 85-yard kickoff return by Darius Slayton in the first quarter after a fumble recovery led to the Eagles' first score. And the Giants have managed to hold on to build on that lead. Regardless of some pretty crappy play from the offensive line, offensive line has let that Eagles defense through quite a bit tonight. Unfortunately, the offensive line players, you just got to suffer through their bad conditions. You cannot change out the offensive line like you can all the other positions in this game. Thank <laughs> you. 
Jerry Rocha with the tackle after a one yard gain. And the Giants hold on to win 35 to 9 over the division rival. Giants, 268 yards of offense, 146 in the air, 122 on the ground. The Eagles, 254, 174 passing, 80 yards rushing. Eagles defense coming up big with four sacks in this game. Giants only had one. However, Giants with an interception and the Eagles with a pretty sizable time of possession, almost four minutes on the time of possession. But the Giants victorious. Barkley 115 yards rushing on the night. We are gonna update our standings. Giants now moving to 7 and 0 on the season, going into week number 8. We've got 103 points against us and 254 in our favor. That's a huge win over a division rival. Giants still holding on to a three-game lead here in the East. I do not play Dallas again this season for some reason. It's like the second season in a row that I haven't had the Cowboys on my schedule, which is highly unusual, but that's just the way that the computer's been scheduling things with this, quote, modified schedule that you do when you play in franchise mode. Buffalo 49ers big victory for them Philadelphia just avenged their loss to the Giants by laying a hurting on the Lions Arizona big win over Miami Chicago a narrow victory over the Broncos Baltimore all over KC Let's see if anybody needs to be edited. Only Sir Ketchlop, Bret Hart getting some more points. hitting power. Even if he don't get a pick, hopefully he can hit somebody hard enough to knock the ball out of their hands. Sir Catch a lot. Just running away here. Everybody's condition here. DJ Chark in bad condition. We'll pull him out. Joe Mixon in bad condition. Washington football team has 
won the coin toss, and they are electing to receive the ball first. Bruce Beard with the kickoff. Wilson back to receive for Washington. He's going to take a knee, and Washington's going to start on their 20-yard line. Gurley and Smallwood in the backfield. Case Keenum, quarterback. Keenum hits Gurley out of the backfield. Gurley gets enough for the first down. 13-yard gain on the play. Gurley going to be stopped for a three-yard loss on that one. Second down and 12, Washington. Scary Terry McLaurin grabs that one. 22-yard gain. field a little bit further I could have had him if I'd have just hit the button and gone right instead of up Sims with the deep ball 32 yard catch Washington now on the New York 15 yard line Smallwood ran into his own guy, but still managed to get three yards on the run. Keenum. Hell no, I didn't win the Super Bowl. <laughs> Blake Martinez with a sack. How you doing tonight, Zide? Oh. Thankfully, incomplete pass intended for Sims. Washington going to try for a field goal. Uh-oh, what'd you have to eat tonight? Field goal is good. Hopkins to kick off, Slayton back to receive. Slayton had an 85-yard return in the last game against the Eagles. Only gonna get four on that kickoff, however. Oh, luckily I wasn't sacked. I held on to that far longer than I probably should have. Capone downfield, Galladay to give the Giants a little bit of breathing space here. 29-yard gain on the pass. More importantly, a first down. Barkley with the handoff. Barkley not going to go too far. Only a yard gain on the play. What would you have to eat tonight, Zide? More of that Subway sandwich that was doing you in last week? Barkley getting a couple extra yards thanks to that block. 16-yard gain on the play. The Saquon. Oh, yeah, that'll do it every time. 
I don't even consider Little Caesars food anymore. It's just grease and cardboard. <laughs> At least the one down here by me is. I've gotten sick every time I've ordered it in the last year since they offered delivery service. Pone. Oh. Way overthrown. Luckily, that was not intercepted. Third down and 12. For the Giants. Galladay deep again. Galladay with another big catch. Tackled on the 15 yard line. 33 yards for Kenny Galladay. <laughs> Boy, I could sure go for a lottery win right about now. I could sure go for a lottery win. $50,000 would solve a lot of problems for me right now. Hell, 30 grand would solve a lot of problems. Fourth down and four, ball on the eight yard line. Ooh, tough, tough call. Fuck it, I'm gonna go for it. Over the middle to Ingram. Touchdown, Giants. 11-yard touchdown on that fourth and short. Probably could have gotten an easy field goal to keep it tied, but the goal of this game is to win, not tie. So had to go for it. Had to go for it that close to the end zone. Right now, you wouldn't have to make me take it, dude. I'm on the verge of <laughs> ruin. <laughs> I've got no pride anymore, my friend. I just need to be able to breathe again and not make the same stupid mistakes that I've been making for the last four or five years in regards to credit cards. Because that is a game that you're never going to win. Keenum. Ooh. If only I had a little bit more speed. I'd have knocked him on his ass. And Smallwood. That little jump gave him the extra push he needed to get that first down. 14-yard gain. Oh. Gurley benefiting from some of my guys just being pushed on their ass. 23-yard gain for Todd Gurley. Who y'all playing tonight? This is a postseason for the NHL too, isn't it? Ah, oh, Scary Terry. Left him wide open. Cannot do that with Terry McLaren. 24 yards to put Washington out front. And you 
you said that the, all the Canadian teams are basically playing amongst themselves because of the border shit, right? I guess whoever emerges out of that setup comes down here to play, or how's that going to work? <laughs> Bundy, no gain on that play. Evan Ingram over the middle, going to be short of the first down. Third down and one. When was the last time Toronto won the, the cup? I don't follow hockey anymore, so I have no idea. Fourth down and one for the Giants. I am going to go for it. Barkley gets the first down easily. Three-yard gain on the play. Only needed a yard. Barkley picking up three through the air. God damn, it's been that long? Holy shit. Ooh. All my back's in bad condition except for... and out of the backfield to pick up another first down for the Giants. 11-yard gain. Who wound up winning the cup last year? I can't remember. Galladay catching it in traffic. Tampa, that's right. Because Tampa won the Super Bowl and the Stanley Cup. It's fixed. Fixed, I tell you. To promote tourism to Florida. <laughs> Joe Mixon on the ground this time for seven. Second down and two for Giants. Knocking on the door here. And Mixon going to be brought down on the goal line. Mixing over the top into the end zone. Touchdown, Giants. And New York back on top. Nice. Well, I will be rooting for the Leafs then. Normally, I would say I would root for the Rangers, but I have no idea what the Rangers even do anymore. So, <laughs> I know they haven't been all that great the last few years. The Islanders have kind of been the New York team with the most traction. Two yard gain on the play for Wilson on that kickoff return. And Washington trying to score one more time before the half. Gurley catching it in the air out of the backfield.
Interception, baby. Oh, shit. Why did I dive? Why did I dive? Jabril Peppers. Seven seconds left on the clock here in the first half. Giants going to try to put one more on the board. Not going to happen. Going to get sacked. Jonathan Allen with the sack. And that's going to do it for the first half. Giants holding on to a 14-10 lead. 29 yards rushing. 121 through the air for 150 total for the Giants. One sack, one interception. And about a minute in time of possession over Washington. has got 36 on the ground, 124 through the air for 160 overall. And the Giants receiving the kick here at the beginning of the third quarter. Darius Slayton back to receive. <laughs> Joe Mixon with the handoff. Not going to go anywhere. Gets a one-yard loss and... <sighs> It's a trip to the locker room. That is going to suck. You'll be glad to put that shit behind you. Pone making a connection to Chark for 11 yards. The ball is moving. The chains are moving. Giants are at midfield now. And Barkley breaks a tackle. Breaks two more tackles. He should have been down with a loss. Extremely fortunate. Ah. Not watching my backside again. Matt. Ionitis with the sack. Frasley over the middle. Frasley fumbles. Washington with the recovery. play for Smallwood. two-yard loss on that. Third down and 11 for Washington. Gurley picks up five. Washington gonna punt here on fourth down. Didn't you have a, a, a hospital bed? You ordered one of those custom a few years back, or... Was I imagining that? Ready, set. 
I thought I remembered you saying that you had ordered one a few years ago. DJ Chark making the clutch catch in between a couple of defenders. 19 yards and a first down. Oh wow, that was even before I knew you. Oh, that sucks. And naturally, they weren't held responsible for it financially, huh? Frasley with the catch. Seven yards this time for Frasley. Fourth down and one for the Giants. Frasley over the middle for the first down. 11 yard gain on the play. Picking up two. Second down. <laughs> Second down and seven for the Giants. <coughs> Ready. Excuse Ready. me. <laughs> oh. Should have just thrown it. John Bostick with the sack. Third down and 12 for New York. Deep to Galladay. Galladay jumping right up in the air to pick that big 52-yard gain. And a first down on the two-yard line for the Giants as time runs out in the third quarter. And Barkley, two yards into the end zone. Touchdown, Giants. And the Giants lead now by 10. About to be 11 here with this extra point as we go into the fourth quarter. I wouldn't mind having one of those beds myself. Just because the last bed I bought back in 2008, 2009... Yeah, it was 2009. That mattress lasted all of about four or five years before I started having issues with it. I don't even sleep in the bed anymore. That's probably why I can't sleep. And we begin the fourth quarter here. Giants lead 21 to 10. Smallwood tackled for a three yard loss. Second down and 12 for Washington. Ready, set, put, put, put. Oh, Terry McLaren. Fumble. That's staying in bounds. Giants recover. Looks like I picked up about 10 yards on the recovery on that. Oh, Washington defense. Gonna make Saquon pay for that fumble. <laughs> Wow, 
Ah, block pass. Yeah, they're not going to pay for nothing nice. Definitely not going to pay for nothing nice, no matter what government it is. Oh, that offensive line just letting them through. Matty and Itis again. Fourth down and 28. Ball on a 37. Going to have to punt this one. <laughs> Dixon's punt. Down to Reeves. Reeves. With a 10-yard return. Washington going to start on their own 14-yard line. Ready. Still down 11 points. Gurley has a first down. A lot more. Todd Gurley with a 26-yard run. 307 left in the ball game. Complete pass intended for Sprinkle, the tight end. Ready. Holy shit, that's an expensive bed. <laughs> and Gurley gonna suffer another loss. Three yards that time. Washington, third down and 13. Gonna call a timeout with 2.44 left. Jerry Rocha with a sack. Gotta gotta send this to Eddie and Jerry. Just for shits and giggles. Jerry is a Dallas fan, and Eddie is a Washington fan. And I've got Jerry on the Giants, which... <laughs> but I like to control my custom players, so... And Gurley catches that. Unfortunately, not going to get the amount of yardage he needs for the first down. Turnover downs for Washington. And all the Giants got to do is just run the timeout. 219 left to play, still up by 11. That would be cool if you could prove somehow that broken bed uh, contributes to your disability. Thirty-eight yard touchdown for Kenny Galladay from Capone. And the Giants putting this one without reach. Twenty-eight ten now. New York over Washington. Wilson with a 17-yard return. Gurley, 8-yard catch. Second down and one for Washington. Minute 24 left in the ball game. Smallwood suffers a one yard loss on the run. Round, 
girly. Well, that's not a big one there. 43 yards. Gurley just 10 yards shy of 100 on the ball game. And Keenum gonna go down again. Blake Martinez, his second sack of the night. Second down and 18. Incomplete pass. Third down and 18, 12 seconds left on the clock. Ready, set, set. <laughs> Smallwood, as time runs out, picks up four yards. New York wins 28 to 10. Hey, you reverse that 10 28. That's my birthday. Giants, a miserable 43 yards rushing, 257 through the air for 300 total. Three sacks, an interception, and a forced fumble, which was recovered for the Giants defense. And about a minute in time of possession over Washington, who had 104 on the ground, 136 through the air, four sacks for the Washington defense, and one forced fumble. Giants, however, back-to-back -back wins over NFC East rivals. And Washington was already behind us by three games. So that is a significant deficit from them. Jerry Rocha getting an improvement point. We are going to give him a little more quickness. It's so hard to get these defensive players leveled up sometimes. We're going to update our stats. 8-0 on the season so far going into week number nine actually we'll be in week 10 because we've got a bye week that we're going to have to sim through we got 113 points scored against us 282 in our favor going into the next game against the Minnesota Vikings fuck you Kirk Cousins See what the rest of the league looks like. Minnesota 8 and 1. 3 games ahead of Green Bay. San Francisco 7 and 1, 2 games ahead of New Orleans and LA. Over in the AFC East, Indianapolis pulls within a game ahead of New England. When I checked this at the end of the stream last week, we had a three-way tie. Indianapolis, New England, and the Jets were all two and three. Of course, we did beat Indianapolis last Tuesday in the final game that we had. We got a tie in the Central, six and two for Cleveland and Baltimore. And in the West, the two-way tie between the Chargers and the Oakland. Let the sim game run. against the Vikings this week. Hopefully get Mixon back. I don't think we will, but... Thank you. 
Vikings. Giants and Vikings. Giants win the coin toss, and of course I'm gonna elect to receive. <coughs> Bailey to kick, Slayton back for the return. 12 yard return for Darius. Barkley out of the backfield, picks up the first down. 11-yard gain on the play. Ready, <laughs> Barkley, six yards on the ground that time, second down and three. Al Bundy going up top, going to hit a two-yard loss. Third down and five for the Giants. Barkley out of the backfield for another first down. Had some glitching going on there. Al Bundy wide open field for Bundy there picks up 12 and the Giants move the chains once again three yard loss on that play from Barkley second down and 12 Minnesota, oh, defense coming in hard and fast. Four yard loss on that play for Saquon. And the Giants facing third and 16 here. Oh, what a waste, what a waste. Fuck it, I'm going for it. Fourth down and 12. Score 0-0. Zero, zero. And I'm going to pay the price. Fuck you, Kirk Cousins. <laughs> Fuck you, Minnesota. Fuck you, Kirk Cousins. Jerry Rocha with a big sack. And you goddamn believe this is going to get fucking capped. Sorry about that. I'm a one-man operation here. <laughs> Jerry and Eddie and Cody bust my balls every week on the Ramble podcast because I can't beat Minnesota in the postseason. <laughs> so, uh, Dalvin Cook not going anywhere on that one. Third down and 19 for Minnesota. Watch that Stefan Diggs play that's built into the run playbook. <laughs> Kirk Cousins going for Smith, not going to make it, and Minnesota going to be forced to punt. Going to watch for the fake. Ooh, it's going to be blocked. Nope. Fair catch was made there. Capone going to Ingram. Not going to make it. Incomplete pass. Oh, threw it away. 
away just as I got hit. And Galladay not going to get that one. It goes right over his head. Third down and ten for the Giants. DJ Chark in traffic. Can't come down with it. Ugh. Giants offense just flat, flat, flat so far in this ball game. Dixon punting it off. Harris back to receive. Come on, tackle the motherfucker. 24-yard gain on the punt return. And Minnesota starting at midfield. Great position here for the Vikings to hit a quick score before the first quarter runs out. Still 0-0. Zero, zero. First down. 20-yard gain for Kyle Rudolph. Now a New York Giant, by the way. Rudolph picked up in free agency this year. Alvin Cook with a three-yard gain. <laughs> Smith. Not going anywhere with that catch. We go to the second quarter. 0-0. Zero, zero. Third down and six for Minnesota. Cousins overthrowing his intended receiver. Minnesota going to attempt a field goal. We're going to watch for the fake, though. We had Philadelphia attempt a fake on the field goal attempt earlier today. Did not work out for them. However, this one goes in. And Minnesota on the board first. Three to nothing over New York. Welcome back, Side. How was the sponge bath, my friend? Ready. <laughs> what do you get? One in the morning and one in the evening? A visit, that is, not a sponge bath. Capone up top, Chark wide open. DJ Chark with a first down catch. 30 yard gain. <laughs> well, hey, for the right amount of money. And a bus ticket to Canada. And I'm not kidding either. <laughs> like I said, I got no pride anymore. First down Giants. Moving the chains. And Barkley with a one yard gain. Second down and nine for New York. Capone going for Frasley. Oh, overthrown. Yeah, but that's like five dollars U.S., right? Sixty million Canadian, five dollars U.S. And Barkley, with that little snag out of the backfield, has another first down. So far tonight, Barkley doing more damage through the air than he's done on the ground. Five yard gain on the play. Second down and four for the Giants. Ready. 
I don't even know what the Florida lottery is. Barkley, touchdown. Thirteen yard run to give the Giants a lead, no matter how brief as it may be. What's your tax rate up there? I imagine for something like that, it would probably be in the 40s or 50s, huh? If you took a lump sum, at least. Oh, he did say they were tax-free earlier. Canadians aren't money-grubbing bastards like the United States government is? That's ridiculous. And you get free health care? Two-yard gain on the play for Dalvin Cook. So far, Cook's been held in check tonight. Oh, I'm sure they will. You'll you'll pay you'll pay something eventually, right? <laughs> free money is never truly free. Minnesota here. Cook. As I said, so far Dalvin Cook's been held in check. Not expecting that to last all ball game, though. But we did force another punt. Watch for the fake. Thomas back to receive for New York. Gonna call a fair catch. Because I am gonna get pancaked. Let's see what our statuses are like. Still bad condition for Bundy. Marlon Mack in good condition, however. We'll bring him in for a little while. Yeah, with that much money, definitely can can make a difference for some people. That's the one thing that's really hurt me the most, especially over the last five years, because I've I've been able to help a few people here and there, but nothing to the extent that I was able to do when I was working full time. And you just feel so useless, you know. Big first down run, 29 yard gain for number 26. I know quite a few people in my immediate friend zone that are having some pretty bad financial difficulties of their own right now. That I would love to be able to help him out if I could, but I can't even help myself most days anymore. <laughs> 92 yards rushing for the Giants, 74 through the air, 166 total. And the Giants with one sack and a big five-minute lead in time of possession. Minnesota, only seven yards rushing, 30 yards through the air for 37 total yards of offense in the first half. How am I losing to this team consistently in the postseason? That's all I want to know. That is all I want to know. Yeah, 
know I'm tough on you sometimes with my opinions about certain things that we've talked about over the years, but if I didn't give a shit about you, I wouldn't be so vocal about some of the stuff that we've talked about over the years. I'd just be like, ah, whatever, do what you want to do. Which is pretty much what I say anyways, because I ain't going to make you do nothing. I just, you know, you ask my opinion, I give it to you. <laughs> no. If you're ever fortunate enough to come into that much money, you should forget that fucktard even exists. I think you waste too much time and energy on him right now as it is. I mean, I understand why you do it. I just think that your talents could be better put to use doing something else than trolling some asshole on YouTube. No matter how hard he deserves to be trolled. First down for the Giants, 11-yard gain on the play. Blue 40 it, blue 40 it. <laughs> and Saquon, another four on the ground. What do you still need to hit that? Did you ever hit the thousand subscriber thing that you needed to get the uh, community thing unlocked, or no? <laughs> Only a yard gain on that play for Mac. Fourth down and three. Ball on a 23-yard line. We are going to punt. Ooh, shallow punt by Dixon. Minnesota going to have great field position here. <laughs> Shit, Minnesota going to kick... Get a fucking punt return on me. Hanging one on my ass. Anthony Harris with a 47-yard punt return. Off of that very shitty punt by Dixon. Ultimately by me, because I'm the one that tapped the button. And the extra point going to be good. Minnesota jumps back into the lead. 10-7 to here. In the third quarter. 221 left to play in the third quarter. Still plenty of time. And Darius Slayton already has one kickoff return for 85 yards and a touchdown in the first game tonight against Philadelphia. It would be ideal for him to get one here. And Saquon dragging a few guys. Seven yard gain on the play. Second down and two for the Giants. Yeah. Any growth is better than none. And what the hell do I know about content creation? Because my YouTube channel, which, granted, my YouTube channel is just to store goofy highlight videos and stuff. I've never tried to produce anything really serious. But my personal YouTube channel, I think, has got like 30 subscribers, so, yeah. The pro wrestling stuff that I have set up, though, has... I think one of them has gotten over a 1,000 subscribers, and then another one's over five or 600. But that's stuff I don't really mess with anymore, so... Touchdown, Kenny Galladay, 53 yards... And the Giants take the lead right back. 
<laughs> you harassing him on Twitter too? You're gonna make that guy snap one day, Zide, and he's gonna come for you. Send me that highlight reel. I want to see this. I haven't been to one of his videos in months, especially with you been being on the mend like you've been. I haven't thought to check in on his latest adventures. Dalvin Cook tackled for a six-yard loss. Cook again. Oh, he broke that tackle. Picks up three. Third down and 12 for Minnesota. Five seconds remain in the third quarter. Giants still lead by four points. And Cook flattened for another six yard loss. Minnesota gonna be punting here. Fourth down and 18. Watch for the fake pass. Thomas back to receive for New York. Galladay, no. That was supposed to go... That was supposed to go this way, not that way. What the hell? That's not even the route he's gonna run. Why the hell are you throwing it that far up? Marlon Mack out of the backfield as Minnesota was closing in. Mack with a 29-yard gain on the catch. <laughs> yeah, he's essential during the pandemic. Being out in public without a mask. Going into, into stores he shouldn't be going into. He should be using a drive-thru. And Marlon Mack has a first down with a five-yard run. Barkley going to get smashed. Four-yard loss on that play. Second down and 13 for New York. Capone keeps it and gets seven yards. Third down and five, Giants. Yeah, he should Ready. just... He should have just kept his mouth shut on that. That's going too far because that's taking digs at people directly during a time when you don't need to be taking digs at people. Touchdown Giants. Thirty-seven yard touchdown run for Barkley. He's gotta be about 150 yards so far on this game. Giants now lead 21 to 10 here in the fourth quarter. 239 remaining in the ball game. And Harris back to receive for Minnesota. Going to take it out of the end zone. Anthony Harris already has one kickoff return for a touchdown in this game. He might have another one. Oh my god, are you fucking serious? Touchdown. 
fuck Kirk Cousins has changed into fuck Anthony Harris. 99 yard kickoff return. And they're going for two. I'm sure an onside kick is going to follow this. <laughs> Dalvin Cook finally. Oh, they are not onside kicking, surprisingly enough. And Darius Slayton already has an 85 yard kickoff return, like I said, in the first game tonight against Philadelphia. Yeah, I mean, you guys have DoorDash and Grubhub type services up there in, in that area, I'm sure. He could have just had shit delivered to him and then done his reviews sitting at home on his kitchen table or something, you know? I don't know what minty com comedic arts is, so... Do they do classic movies or current movies or a mix of both? Ah, oh, ran out of bounds a little too soon on that. Third down and one. Yeah, fuck that guy, man. And Barkley up the middle. Broke one tackle. Two tackles. Finally brought down from behind at the 15-yard line. 40-yard gain for Barkley. 186 yards rushing tonight. Send that to me on Facebook. I'll have to check it out. I've never heard of that channel. And Marlon Mack into the end zone for another six points. And the Giants jump out to another 10-point lead with this extra point. 28-18 to 18 here. Time running out in the fourth quarter. 44 seconds left on the clock. Still plenty of time for the Vikings to come back. And me, that was a good movie. I remember that. Ready, set, put, put, put. <laughs> Kirk Cousins going down, baby. Blake Martinez with his first sack of this ball game. Second down and seventeen. Her cousin stepping up, throws it horizontally. Incomplete pass. Yeah, it's, it's one of those movies that was always on HBO. That's how I remember it. It's one of those movies I would have watched late night or something when I couldn't sleep. 20 yard gain. Kirk Cousins only 64 yards passing tonight. Minnesota's two big scores off of kickoff returns from Anthony Harris. Including a 99-yarder. And that, as they say, is the ball game. New York wins 28-18. Two hundred and twenty four yards rushing for the Giants, one eighty three through the air for four oh seven total. Thirteen and a half minutes. Time of possession, only six and a half minutes for the Vikings. Minus one yard rushing for Minnesota. And only sixty four yards in the air. <laughs> Why can't I do this to them in the postseason? That's all I want to know. That's all I want to know. They consistently just kick my ass. And we are going to update our stats. 
now at 9 and 0 on the night or on the season going into week number 11 3 and 0 on the night we've got 131 yard or points against us 310 for us How are we looking offensively and defensively? My offense is slidden down to number 27. <laughs> I started out after the first week, I was number three overall or number five overall offense. And last week I was down to like 17, now I'm down to 27. Oh well. <coughs> defensively, however, number one, baby. Number one in all three categories. 583 yards total rushing. The next highest total there is 899, the 49ers defense. We're going to see if anybody else needs an edit tonight. Jerry Rocha getting improvement. We are going to give Jerry... We're going to give him just a little more on the quickness. And let's see. never get a chance to raid this guy. one of the premier Tecmo Bowl guys on Twitch. Thanks for hanging out, everybody. If you could still hang out for the raid here, it would be appreciated. I guess everybody left. Oh, well. I'll be back tomorrow night for Wind Waker Wednesday. Thanks for hanging outside. And I will see you guys hopefully tomorrow night. Take care.